This week on 3D Printed Soup, this plus this could equal disaster unless you print a lifesaver. That's right after this. Hello fellow makers and welcome back to 3D Printed Soup. This week I purchased myself a Steam Deck and yeah this thing is whoa. Okay I put that on but uh, yeah it's a very real issue. The case is lovely, protects it really nicely, but if you do pick it up by the handle and it's not closed, it will flip out and cause no end of drama to you. And yes, Valve have made it uh, right to repair, so you can repair it yourself, but you really don't want to have to do that if you can help it. So what you can do is print a thing called a lifesaver, which is an awesome 3D printed clip that goes into your Steam Deck's case and you can clip it in and it keeps it happy, smiley, and unfractured and unblemished. It's made by these people right here. It's open source, but don't try and sell it because, you know, it's their product and their design. But yeah, print it for yourself, print it for your friends and family. Just don't sell it for cash because that's a tad unethical. Now, before we continue with this print showing you how to protect your wonderful new Steam Deck, thanks to everyone who has liked and subscribed. Tons of you now. Welcome to the 3D printed community, which is 3D printed soup, keeping you and your possessions safe since 2020. Now, let's get on and print ourselves a really cool 3D printed lifesaver for your new toy. Let's get down to this. Okay, let's uh, attach this last piece of felt to make sure it doesn't scratch the Steam Deck and let's give this a try. So here is my Steam Deck. As you can see, I have got it uh, unzipped. And if you lift it up, it falls straight out and that could be disastrous if you're uh, on an airplane or if you're uh, walking down some stairs or if you just lift it up on the table and it bounces off the floor. So I'm gonna take this thing out and we're gonna attach the new lifesaver to it. Okay, so here it is, and this just jams into the case. First thing you do is you thread the uh, little material tab here through the bottom, like a buckle, and then thread it back through the uh, top here. Okay, once that's done, you pull it tight, and then you clip the Steam Deck lifesaver down and tuck the ribbon through the big hole at the top. Now this is the really important bit. You've got to make sure this is insecure. The bottom bit here goes under the bottom section there and the top bit at the top here must go right underneath that lip at the top. It's got to jam right under there, otherwise this thing will not work and will just pop out. Now the Steam Deck's sort of hand sewn as far as I can work out, so uh, each one is just slightly different. So make sure you've jammed it right in there, otherwise it will keep falling out and it won't protect your Steam Deck. All right, with that safely secured, let's put the Steam Deck in. I've put some craft foam on the top and bottom of this thing so it won't scratch the deck itself. And this just clips in like so and holds it nice and snug. But because you've got craft foam on it, none of the 3D printing parts attach and it won't scratch. So here we go. Let's do it up. And here we go. Undo it, put it down and lift and... No, this thing is not going anywhere. I'm giving that a good shake and that is not falling out. It's gripping it beautifully. But you just pop the two bits up and it comes out no problem at all. No scratches, no lines, just 
absolute safety so basically you don't end up dumping your expensive piece of uh, gaming technology straight onto a concrete floor down some stairs which as we've all done in the past when you watch your lovely iPhone 13 bouncing down some concrete um, far exit yeah it really makes you cry now the lifesaver is available in several different flavors this particular one I printed out has got SD card storage so each one of those little um, arches down there holds an SD card so it holds six so you can hold six SD cards in there and one in the Steam Deck itself so yeah you've got more than enough storage to basically last you as many flights as you need yeah this is absolutely fantastic design and I'm really happy about why it's come out okay with this printed out it is absolutely fantastically designed Steam Deck just sits in there won't come out give it a shake and yeah that holds it and clips it into the body of the Steam Deck case very, very nicely and protects it from falls. But, uh, or falls, either one. Uh, but yeah, you can just pop this thing out very, very simply. Pop it back in. And yeah, that holds it nicely without any risk or worry of it coming out of the case. But just pop it open and out it comes. Yeah, very, very happy with that. Pay attention to the instructions on the website and on this video, which I showed you earlier. Make sure that one, you've threaded this ribbon thing through the little buckle here and that you have made sure the ends are tucked underneath the threading there and underneath the threading properly there so that it is properly secure. Otherwise, this thing will pop out. But yeah, that is a brilliant thing to stop you causing untold damage to your beautiful new piece of technology. Links in the description below for this print as always. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Stay happy and safe. Keep printing.